<laughs> hey, what up? <laughs> hey, man, I'm talking to you. <laughs> Is that Bob Bali? Is that Bob? Hey, Bob, can I have your autograph? <laughs> can I have your autograph, Bob Bali? <laughs> man, if you guys can't tell, I'm like super fucking baked right now. It's, it's not even funny. You see what it says? It says smoke two joints. And I just had me two big, bold, bold motherfuckers, man. <laughs> hey, Bob Bali, I want your freaking autograph, man. <laughs> oh, man, what the, what the, what the hell, what the hell just happened, man? I was just like, I <laughs> oh, man, hey, YouTube, what up? What up? <laughs> Oh man, shit, that is a play, man. That is a <laughs> hey, YouTube, opinionated review here. Bring you guys a video on anime lock screen. And you guys can see I have this, like, this raster about about lock screen, high and shit, just dancing around for no freaking reason. <laughs> it's what it's called, anime lock screen. It's supposed to be, it's in one of those damn repos, whether it's the big boss or whatever. But basically, what it allows you to do is have animated lock screen. Now, you guys should be familiar with animated boot logos, and it uses the same thing, but it uses them for animated lock screen so this is an animated boot logo and you guys can see it's on my lock screen now we're gonna go into the settings and check out uh, a couple of these or uh, probably just one more you guys can see it installs the animated boot logo thing here but I don't need to use that if you want to use it you can but this one here where it says animate lock screen I could go in here and actually configure this a little bit to my liking I'm not gonna go through these custom background um, settings and all that bullshit I'm going to basically talk about just the bottom ones and this one up here, whatever. First of all, you have to enable and disable. You have to enable the tweak if you want it to work. And then you have to uh, select a custom boot logo, whatever. I'm going to change this one to this one right here, which says Stewie Hate Apple. I love this one. Boom. That's so awesome. We're going to see it on the lock screen when we go out. And you have to respring when you go ahead and apply it. But I, I like that you can preview. That That comes from, oh, uh, it actually respring by itself. I guess it's probably crashed or whatever. But we'll see what happened. Ah, there we go. It actually resprung by itself and it didn't crash. So that's the one I just enabled, which is the Stewie Hates Apple one. I love that one. So, yeah. Well, as I said, you have to download animated boot logos from CDN. There's a section for that. I actually have a top 10 animated boot logos, which is super, super, super freaking old, but you can still check it out. Link in the description. And as I said, you can select the boot logo that you want. I have a couple that I downloaded here. And when you finish, you have to respring for it to apply. The only thing you don't have to respring to do is adjust any of these. So if I want the boot logo to be super slow, I can just go ahead and do that. I mean, super fast. That one is super fast. All the way up is super slow. And you guys can see it's actually super slow. There, you don't have to respring for that. You only have to respring when you change it. As you said, the custom background shit, I'm not interested in all of that shit. You guys can play around with it if you want to. This one is show the original background. If you enable this, it's going to disable custom background, which I didn't go through. Uh, hey, if you do not have this on where it says non-charging mode, if this is off, you're not going to see anything unless your device is charging. So make sure you turn that on if you want it to actually be on. And you can see the battery here is in the way when this is enabled. So I just take off the battery if I don't want that in the way. You can actually move the battery. So if I put the battery here, I can actually move it on the X and Y axis. If you're familiar with calculus, I can actually re resize the battery and stuff so you can see where the battery is and that's basically I don't use that setting so I just have that off now the main attraction is the wall, the lock the lock screen wallpaper itself I doubt anybody will be using any of those other um, settings but that's basically it for this there's a section inside CDO where you can go ahead and actually download boot logos or you can just search boot logos and check it out so yeah guys as I said this one is called animate lock screen it's in the Big Boss Reaper for $1. It's a matter of preference if you want to get a nut. With that being said, please rate, comment, subscribe. Have a nice day. Make sure you show that thumbs up button some love. And if you aren't subscribed, what are you waiting on? Hit the subscribe button above. Like my Facebook fan page and follow me on Twitter. I answer questions a lot faster on Twitter than I do on YouTube. Oh yeah, and check out my previous video if you haven't already.